Yeah, so good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, my good, good, good viewers. So welcome to my YouTube channel, Zach Discoveries. It's a lovely morning that, <coughs> sorry, that I'm coming live from Nyamwini. And um, it's a lovely moment that we are meeting again. We thank God for giving us this opportunity to have this day in our life. Many people are sick, many people are in the ICU, many people are hospitalized. But you're having that opportunity to be alive. So it's a privilege. And we thank God. So I'm at this place at Baba God's Frey's place. And uh, we have some activities that are taking place. So I'm just uh, walking here. Trying to check something else before I go and show you the activities that are taking place there. So we have this, this path. Okay, I can call it a footpath. Okay, the initially, before this person planted this maize, this, uh, uh, the, the footpath was somewhere here, where at least a uh, pickup could pass. Huh? So, unfortunately, um, what happened is that uh, as he was digging, he dug it. He dug that place where we used to walk. So I'm trying to think to think what will happen because um, yesterday we were fellow the boy and uh, we were talking about the sand that we could bring this place and uh, so we were trying to think of what to do because we really need sand we really need sand now we i wanted to bring up like two pickups but uh, we saw that uh, we agreed that it will cost us so we agree that we bring a tipper. Tipper, that is a damper, as fellow the boy usually call it. A damper of pickup, a damper of uh, sand, sorry. As you can see this friend of mine has brought some sand here. So I was thinking, I was thinking, maybe I come with Baba Godfrey so that we can uh, see where we can put the, the sand. Because this land is someone's land and they are plowing. So the damper cannot uh, put it there. And also, I don't know. I don't know whether I can put it here. So, and this, this road is very small that the damper can pass. And unfortunately, uh, the, the maize have already germinated. You can see this person's maize, they've already germinated. I don't know why this happened because you're supposed to leave at least. Okay, unless they knew that this place is enough for like a pickup to pass. A pickup can pass here, but uh, the problem is that this, these are thorns. Mm. These are thorns. So the tires could get uh, punctured. <laughs> and that will be disadvantage to the owner of the car because there's no need of bringing sand and you take the whole money and repair the, the tire. So let me get Baba Godfrey so that at least we can uh, we can console each other and see where we can uh, put that sand. Chebet mwenye, mambo vipi? Ah, chebet mwenye na gambu tibo. Hey, guys, you are the people. You bought one of you bought these ladies this gambu. Turn it up now. Oh, scary chai. Hi, Kimbia. So that's chebet. She has been sent by the dad to go and get. Uh, and they get sugar, sugar they want to make. Yeah, so guys, that is, uh, they are going to make, here they weigh, I don't know whether you get the word weigh, they measure, is it measure or weigh? No, they weigh sugar in terms of uh, the amount you want. So they start with 50 shillings. So I think the father has given him the, the, 40, the 50 shillings to buy. So from far, that is the home. That is what we are having at, at last. We're having that look of the homestead of Baba Godfrey. So this road, this road, I don't know, I don't know. So let me get there then now. Uh, we we'll hear what he's thinking about. So this electricity, last time, by the way, these guys, they are supposed to be having electricity. You remember I said that uh, uh, this Kenya Power, we have a, a company here that is called, called Kenya Power. Uh, limited KPLC Kenya Power Lightning 
company yeah kenya power lighting company so they installed this electricity the company the, the 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 company that was given that tender is called rare rare that is rural electrification authority but they were under the same same kenya power so inside here i think it's the meter that is supposed to be here that some wiring are done there i don't know what they are there they can see so this cable from that post from this post and in fact they gave them the best posts because these are concrete posts that do not rot so no matter how long they stay here they they don't rot so they were supposed to have electricity that is a meter now this that that days when they're supposed to have a meter in that box meter that means the a gadget that reads how much electricity you are using but i'm told um there's a disconnection somewhere up there you see where those wires that are going up there like this there's a disconnection somewhere up there can you imagine what well, something is a monopoly is very bad so these guys were told the kenya power guys were told to come and do the reconnection so that these guys can have electricity because rare came so that anybody in the villages can have you can see like that lining there you can see that post there that's another line of kenya power the same so that one is working but this one is not working it's unfortunate guys it's unfortunate so they never came they never came yeah so these people could be having light then we could have um the the construction we are making there we could also be having light but uh, unfortunately they did not come i don't know whether they are put, they will be pushed i don't know whether the 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 these people okay these people by the way this village one thing about this village is that most guys most youths are drunkards they drink a lot but we thank god that the government is having a rule that is doing with the local brew we thank god that one is going to save many 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 people many generation people are selling their land just to drink which is not good yeah, so as i'm taking around the compound this is how the structure will look from far yeah, this is where, where i'm walking is a footpath where people will be passing and seeing so imagine this structure being plastered to be very lovely very wonderful very nice yeah so let me meet bagot free so that we can Lydia, gambu tiko komugu. How are you doing? You are fine. Unaenda wapi ba? Udupa? Oh. Hapo ndo unamwaga. Salimia watu marafiki zako hapo. Salimia tu wafanye hivi. Nasema good morning. Yes, uko poa? Haya. Yeah, this is Lydia. A uh, very good girl. We thank God for her because she's a very responsible girl. Yeah, we thank God, guys. You can see how these people—they are very clean. You remember the last time I came and these flowers only that we have come here for some time and we have stepped on them. But the time that I was not here, these flowers they were in a line, very good line, all the way to that corner where the house is. So, yeah, they have already cleaned the compound. They have organized everything. Ah, Baba Godi. Mambo vipi rafiki? Salamu. Eh uko fit? Yes. Yeah. Usafi tu. Usafi. Ndio. Ah, asubuhi. Ah, maliza uje tusikie. Maliza uje tusikie. Yes. Mrembo. Habari ya leo? Yi. Ni vijana uliniambia mama nani? Ni mama Elia. Amelia. Ah, ile jina yako niambia ni Eliza. Eliza o. Oh. So guys this is Eliza the lady that is now helping us in terms of uh, the second molly you can see how she's doing it you can see so it's quite it's quite a tedious activity because this one is even in fact more harder than the first one reason uh, she's uh, she's using more of the mud than the first because you have to cover all these rafters all these rafters you have to cover so she has to put a thick thick mud 
so that they are covered. So she has already finished that end where you are seeing a, a ladder leaning. Sorry about the light. She has. How now? I see good Trisha. No. Okay. Okay. So she has finished from this side where you are seeing the, the the window reaching. So she's coming like this. Yeah, so someone asked about what will happen to the to the floor. We have to use this this um this soil that was on the ground here to make the mud. In fact, she has made a lot of mud, and likely enough today she might finish it inside, which is a very good show, very good thing that because we might finish inside and tomorrow she starts from the outside. So I was talking about someone asked about what will happen to this. Floor, the, the floor so we are having we are going to fill the floor with the moral i'll let you know where the moral will be coming from but that is it so where pambana mama siniko pambana so guys I will, this is the lady that there's another one ule wa maji anaweka wapi maji humu ndani no ah so ukitumia anaongeza ana una ana una ta drum bwana nafaa kuwa na drum bwana my friend, mm. fuck on a drum. So I'm going to my job today. So the lady that is helping us with water, not helping us, but she's doing the job of bringing water, is this one. Yeah, so. Yeah, so that is water she's putting in that drum. So she's helping us in terms of water. Ah. Yeah. So, Sasa hii tangeneza chai kiasi gani? Sasa this is sugar guys. This, this is for 30 shillings. Yeah, that is life. Now that is the village life. Hmm. Yeah, so that is it guys. We are still on. And um so baba god. Niko nataka kuuliza hiyo sehemu ya ya njia huko. Yo, nataka tulete mchanga tip. Nzima. Mchango na ule mzee anaweza turuhusu tumwage huko kwake. Mzee. Huyu huyu. Vanyo. Eh. Sababu mbaya tunahitaji mchanga tip nzima. Kama kuna sehemu hapa juu. Inaweza pita. Hapo. Hapo. Eh kwenda huko. Hakuna. So we are trying to console where we can put the sand because we need the whole sand. Whole whole tip. Yeah, so guys, let's go there so that we check. We want to check where we can put the sand. Huh? Because you see, all the way from where you are seeing those children are. All the way from there. Let me try to pull. I don't know where it will be clear. Quite a distance. That is where... The, the, a, a vehicle cannot pass toward the God, God place, God phrase place. But let's go there, we contemplate and we see what can happen. Because we need to get away forward. Because if we, if we don't get away forward, that means that uh, we are not going to be successful. I don't know whether we shall bring with the, with the tipper, then from the tipper, then we we'll give some boys to carry to the other side. I don't know. Let's go and check out. So stay tuned, my dear ones. Yeah, so guys, we have come back. As I told you that uh, we were going to check the, the place where we shall pass the, the tipper, the damper, with the, the sand. Eh? So, in fact, we were going around the village. Yeah, so we had a problem. We, had, we have some difficulties. That is uh, the place where we shall, in fact, put the sand is a bit far from the homestead because these people they usually farm you know we have those villages that they live and they don't in fact think of one day a vehicle can come to their compound so what happened uh, they, and they are very lucky that nowadays we have uh, motorbikes you know motorbikes usually pass a very small space so motorbikes go inside even the, the maize plantations to get the maize out of that place to where a vehicle is so we have located one place but what i'm going to do as we have agreed with the, um, this guy it's baba godfrey 
and uh, the neighbors. I just come with the guy who is having the damper, uh, especially the, the turn boy or the, the driver, it's the turn boy or the conductor. So I'll come with the, one of them. So he'll just survey the area. He sees how the area is, then he will uh, advise. Because we need, there's no need of bringing a, a pickup. A pickup will cost us more because they will take more pickup than expected. And this place is the distance, but it is very far, the distance. So, uh, but it's quite far than even Kengariso at Mama Fred and Mama Maria's place. So that is why it's going to be hectic. First of all, it's going to cost us in terms of uh, the, the transportation of the sand by the pickup to this place. And they're going to bring more because when this house, that's bought for plastering outside and inside. Because I told you that I have already paid for eight cements from the money that I got. Uh, I've already paid for the glasses and the labor for that guy who was uh, yesterday taking the measurement for the glass panes. So for the door and the window, we have the glass pane well catered. I paid for the eight cement that we're going to use down on the floor. That is to put the tiles. If we get the tiles, we have for plastering inside and outside. That is uh, why I'm thinking of bringing the, the sand. So the sand will be used here and the other sand is children that uh, want to say funny. Now, now God himself, yes. So the reason why I'm saying that uh, we need uh, more sand is because we are working on the, already on this. So last evening I got 20,000. The person who sent the money said that I've sent you that money so that you start with the toilet. The pit latrine. So we have already an act another activity that is taking place here. One of the guys that is working here is here. Yes. Sema, good, good morning. Good morning, morning to her. I'm good. And I hope they are good. Those people who are watching, I hope they are good. Eh? Yeah. So you can tell us your name? I'm Charles. Yes. We're just working here. Yes. Yeah. All right. Thank you. We are at work. You are at work. Uh, yes, I'm, we are working. Yeah, that uh, Nyamweni. Nyamweni. Village. Nyamweni village. Yeah. Yes. So we have another guy here. This guy, you're used to him. Yeah, there's a time they were working with the pastor somewhere. So my friend. Yeah. How Yes. Ile jina kwa alikuwa na kujua na wani gani? Just for tomorrow. Just for tomorrow. Ya mari ingine mwingine rafiki yangu wako huko senke. Senke. Tulichipandika senke. Ya otenga. Otenga mwilijipandika na mwilikuwa watatu. Unawele watofari wewe na otenga. Watofari na otenga. Alright. Tunaitana senke. Yes, but his name ni Marwa. His real name is Bana Marwa. So Marwa karibu. So wendo engineer hapa sasa leo. Sio pasta tena. Hapasta ni meona ngufu saki. Amekuwa mzee sasa meniachi. All right, all right. So muko na urafiki yangu hapa. Okay. Ni tunasaidiana. Good. So karibu sana ba. So guys I contracted this guy because uh, you know the other time he was under someone. He was under pastor. So he was being directed by the pastor, but he's a guy that I've mostly worked with. So and he's good. So we are going to get um a pit latrine. We call this one a pit latrine. Godi. Tunataka tukutengeneze sehemu nyingine hapa. Huyu unakunia, si ndio? Godi ni makidogo. Si ndio godi? Eh lakini hii itakuwa ina mlango. Si ndio godi? Itakuwa na mlango alafu alafu utakuwa unaogea sehemu nyingine. Si ndio? Badala ya kwenda mdo na eno leta tu maji unaogea ha? Si itakuwa sawa. Yeah, so guys the measurement for this pit latrine is 3 by 6 feet. Downward we are going to make 15. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that is an enough enough. Okay, let me use the word toilet because most of you understand well the toilet. We are going to have a very lovely toilet. That means we are going to have one bathroom and we are going to have two toilets. So that means one side will be for the ladies. That is because this this place this the Baba Godfrey has girls. So one side will be for the ladies. And the other door will be for the gents. So we are going to have three doors in this in this toilet. So work has already begun. So my friend, Ebu Ambia, what you What you? Five hundred. Five hundred. Per foot. Per foot. Yeah. And you are going to make downward fifteen yeah. foot, fifteen feet. Yeah. So five hundred times fifteen feet. Nafani kulipe pesa kada. Saba na kitu, Saba miyatano. 
That is what the cost of digging this. And we are really praying that to spot a mawe. We are hoping wow. to spot a mawe. Sao, sao. E tu naomba. Tu naomba. E, ifiki yo futi kumina dhana. Sao, sao. Sabi mzali niambia, hmm? kabla ajaanza hiyo alichimbianga hapa. Hmm. Akapata hiyo mawe hapa. Akarudi akapanda juu akaenda zaidi akaenda karibu 20. Eh, tena akapata. Ah, akupata. Ah, akupata. Kwa hivyo hapa kuna uwezo isikue hapa. Ah, sasa. Naomba Mungu sababu gani? Kile tunahofia hiyo jiwe, inaacha likaranda hiyo. Mhm. Wewe chimba tutaona. Sasa tuchimbe tuone. Eh, chimba tutaona. Eh, kwa sababu hata nimeanza kuona kadari kadiri hapa. Oh. Eh. No me iphone kata. Sasa ndio tunataka twende chini. Tuone kama itakwepeka. Hapo ni kukaa kutu ngapi? So ili ili likwambaka pale mwisho. Kuanzia hapa hivi. Lakini hapa hivi pana sikwa kwenda chini. Oh. Sijui kama hebu chini. Himba kwa hivyo sasa siunge ileta hivi basi kama umeshapata hapo. Siunge songesha hapo. Unajua tumeona watu wangalia kama zakuta. Ni hapo tu hivi. Iliko tu juu. Iliko juu. Oh lime okay. Sasa tukitoa mchanga tutapata dalili kwamba utaona kama linaendelea kama mtaona linaendelea mwisho. Msongesha kidogo. Eh alafu tutaongea tutaelewana hapo. Yeah so that's guys that's what we are contemplating on because we don't want to have some obstacle that are hindering us from going down. We want to get 15 feet down so that we start the construction. So nataka kufanya mchakato Lydia. Hii ni choma mama. Eh, mtu asikuja kurukaruka hapa. Eh, lakini tunataka tufunike ile. So when I was talking about uh, the flow, I talked about when I said that we shall put moram. We shall get moram from this pit latrina. So there's moram that will come from the, the 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 red one, the red soil. So when we get it from here, we shall uh, we shall now put on the floor of that room of that structure that we're constructing for the boys there. So yesterday I told you that this is the place that we are thinking about making a bohol. Uh, so from here the compound will be fully set. If we happen to get a wire to put round, it will be well and good. If we don't happen to get a wire, what you people have done so far, and we really appreciate God for giving you the energy and the ability to help the poor. May God bless you. May God give you good health. You can see like it's like a miracle the children are already wondering that oh god is good so they're helping us in terms of getting a toilet so thank you so much i'm just praying you god to stay you god to give you good health and resurrection from zack discovery bye bye so let me get the girl of the tip the dapper so that you can come and contemplate on the what happened here in terms of sun delivery bye bye